Hello my friends, my name is Bogdan Kurta and we have here the insight of um, um, exceptional in my opinion Yamaha MG16XU uh, mixer. Uh, it has also uh, audio interface, uh, two channels in and two channels out. For this is the U from interface and the X um, is because of course it has uh, the DSP processor here we are seeing the screen with two digits which it's uh, indicating the effects which are uh, more than uh, adequate they are really good uh, effects um, okay very 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 practical for life and also you can use them uh, in studio uh, we are seeing here the microphone preamps i want to tell you um, that uh, this mixer doesn't have any technical problem. It's my own mixer and I open it uh, especially and only for cleaning purposes. Um, we are seeing here that we have decent component, decent component. Uh, we have also um, Neutric uh, connections, Canon or XLR connections, how you prefer to call it. We are seeing here also the uh, Vometers. Uh, how you are seeing there, I will try to zoom or to close the phone. The capacitors are good quality capacitors and also the preamps, they are discrete preamps. So um, we are speaking here about the D preamp from Yamaha, um, which in my opinion it's sounding a lot, a lot better than the very... <laughs> Modest, in my opinion, uh, mediocre, I will say, preamps that you are finding in uh, uh, Scarlett, Focusrite Scarlett, and even Claret audio uh, interfaces. We cannot compare them with uh, Safari or Safari. So they are very, very good preamps, uh, in my opinion, at uh, studio level. And for live, they are totally exceptional. Um, they are not like in the Yamaha 01X, the old mixer, which has a special and very generous, very big coil here, which is giving you a warmer sound. Um, these preamps are sounding more clear, but you don't have that vintage uh, feeling. However, if you want to uh, obtain some vintage feelings, you have the compressor knob. Yes, it will be, you cannot see it here because of course it's open this mixer. Uh, the yellow button, if, if you put this button, this switch at uh, um, middle, you will go uh, together with the compression, of course, also a warmer uh, sound. You can compensate this giving some heights from the parametrical EQ. A very interesting mixer with a lot of uh, outs also, with two groups. The EQ is parametric um, and it's working exceptionally. I used him uh, in uh, live situations and also in a studio situation. Now especially that my old Focusrite Safari uh, it's broken and uh, I really observe a very good improvement unexpected because um, this device theoretically it's made for live and uh, they make a big mistake these uh, engineers and uh, especially the staff marketing staff from Yamaha because they don't market they don't make a little uh, more publicity uh, on these products MG series as a studio mixers which really they are and they are uh, working very 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 nice in this uh, way i will uh, come back with another uh, review of this uh, amazing uh, piece of equipment audio equipment um, after uh, some time of course it will be close <laughs> the mixer and you will see it in all his beauty and will have there also an audio test yes i can recommend you this uh, product i'm not paid from uh, Yamaha, they didn't send me the mixer, I bought it for myself with my own money and how I told you, I was also at a lot of events with him and also use him uh, in um, a studio environment for tracking vocals, keyboards 
and uh, everything that I need. And now it's my main uh, audio device for my PC until I will got something stronger, something more complex, which uh, it will be again, uh, of course, a Yamaha, a Steinberg actually. Until uh, the next time, don't forget to subscribe and uh, we'll see and uh, we'll um, have another opportunity to meet um, with other uh, new videos and I hope that they will be more and more interesting uh, with uh, a lot of good and uh, always correct information.